Hello, hola, and hey. Can you hear me now? So this is what I brought myself. I went ahead, I think I told you in a um, recent vlog, but I went ahead and upgraded to the iPhone Pro Max. iPhone 12 Pro Max. This is what I got myself. My hair is still in this net. It's my birthday today and I don't want curls to drop. So that's why I may look a little crazy. But I am going from this phone here. This is my phone that I currently have. This is the iPhone 8 Plus. Our nine-year-old daughter is going to use this phone. She uses it anyway for her um, video editing and all her little stuff. So let's get on with the unboxing of my new iPhone. So I already peeled that off. And it came by FedEx Tuesday, I think. Today is Friday. And I waited to open it. I'm already expecting not to have a charger, but I got the Pacific Blue side by side. When you open it up, this is what it looks like on the inside. It has this sheet protector covered on top of it. That's different. And on the inside, it has the, which is just your Apple symbol sticker, and then I guess a little, oh, and then the little thing for your uh, SIM cards. Yeah, for your SIM card. And then it has this piece right here. Wasn't expecting a whole charger, but it did come with this cord. Sometimes Apple products can be iffy with certain cords, so. I like to use the cord that you that comes with the phone because sometimes if you use a different cord, even though it's the same cord, but it's somebody else's cord from their phone, your phone, believe it or not, will start messing up. That's what I have experienced. I don't know if it's just me. If it's not, if you know what I'm talking about, let me know down in the comments down below. But let's move on with the unboxing of my new iPhone 12 Pro Max. It is so cute. I didn't want the. I thought I wanted to go at first, but I've had gold. I've had black. I've had like white or whatever this one here is white and um see it's like white right there white and then rose gold so i wanted something different and so i got the pacific blue and let's just pull that up. there we go nice okay i don't think it's bigger it's not bigger it said 12 pro max but it's the, the boxy shape like the square boxy shape this one, if you remember the 8 Plus, this one has the round edges. Yeah, like, it's definitely, I think it is like a tad bit bigger. Good. Let's see, up close. It's like, just the 8 Plus was like a tad bit bigger. Or maybe, I think with this one though, you get more screen versus this one. Yeah. So maybe that's the difference it makes up for the difference with this this one you get more screen than you do with this one because this one has all this up here and this down here but I'm not no tech person okay and also I do FYI I have Samsung Galaxy I'm team Samsung Galaxy I'm just team Samsung and team Apple I use this one on my as my main phone this um, Samsung Galaxy phone I use this one as my phone that's my cute little half of my family that's not all of us i am considering now swapping which i had a verizon tech call me yesterday and i missed the um a call but she was calling me back so she can help me set it up and switch my main phone from this one to the apple because like most of the people that i communicate with they have apple phones not all of them but a lot of them and so when i'm texting with people on this phone they can like and heart my comments and stuff like that but i cannot do i cannot do that to them on this phone and so my my kids all of my kids have apple phones have apple phones and i found that i do like using majority of my apps on the apple phone because people design phones or not phones but people design apps more so for the Apple phone and so I, I've noticed that majority of the time certain apps work differently and better on my iPhone than they do on my Samsung and I also also was told by my daughters like whenever I post snapchats or whatever through this phone that it shows, it shows up 
it shows up blurry on their iPhones. I'm like, What's, that's a conspiracy against Samsung. Shame, shame, shame on y'all. So I really, I've all, I've been Samsung, Team Samsung for a long, long, long time. And I most likely will continue to be. But I think I'm going to just switch it up a little bit now. And because most of the people that I communicate with have iPhones, it'll just be easier and funner, I believe, to switch my main line to the iPhone now. So, yeah. We'll see how that goes. But if I don't like it, um, I can always switch back because Verizon lets us do that. So, yeah. Shout out Verizon. Can you hear me now? <laughs> but that's pretty much it. I have not ordered my case. I have to order a case for this phone before. I want to um, like cut it on and activate it and stuff. But I don't. Yeah, I need to do that because I need to take some fly pictures. It's my birthday today, and everything. And this camera right here. Oh, it should be. It should be bomb.com. I know they don't say that no more, but hey, you know, it's not coming on. Hello, hola, and hey. Hello, Moto. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Hello, Apple. Swipe up. I'm sure you've done, done this before and seen many of people do it. It came up for me to set up the iPhone quick start. Yeah, this is my iPhone 12 Pro Max. <laughs> Oh, what happened to my eye? Oh, my eye fell out? Where my eye? Oh, no. Don't tell me I did this video all this time and I was missing. Oh, my goodness. Okay, I'm good. I'm in the clear. I looked back at this video and I was there. Apparently, I dropped it when I was reaching for it to show it to you. 